Hello everybody. Welcome to Scotty Side. Thanks for joining me today. I want to discuss why uh, one of the main reasons why I think that people hate or make fun of or simply just choose not to understand MGTOW at all. Um, and basically what it boils down to is control. Um, men that are going their own way can't be controlled. Uh, you guys, you boys, my boys that are watching this know all too well that people want you to fall in line. They want you to be part of the machine and be a cog in the machine and men that go their own way and focus on themselves worry about their own finances, their own health, think for themselves, can't be controlled. Society, women especially, because it's a gynocentric society that we live in, uh, they need men. Whether they, they, whether they talk about how men suck and men this and kill all men and blah, 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 doesn't matter Society, the world, needs men. Point blank, simple, period. So, when when the, the MGTOW guys, which is growing, by the way, and this is why they're so concerned, because more and more men are saying, fuck this shit, I'm out. And so, when more and more men are stepping off the plantation doing their own thing, saying fuck it to everyone else, you can't control that. You can't make them be part of the machine. You can't make them join the military or uh, do the shitty jobs that only men will do. And that's concerning, and they should be concerned. Because society will fall apart. Uh, things won't be maintained. New technologies will not be created. And this country will fall by the wayside. And, you know, women women want their luxuries. They, I mean, I do too. I'm not blaming them for that. But, you know, I don't hate men and I don't despise them. I don't think they're toxic. You know, some guys are assholes, yeah. But that doesn't... That's not the whole point of it. It's like, I respect what other people go through, men or women. <clears throat> and as much as I talk shit about women here, it's it's their nature. I'm not, I don't hate women. Uh, but people that, the people that don't know of MGTOW, who think of MGTOW, are like, oh, they're just a bunch of incel weasels. Yeah, Jordan Peterson. <laughs> um, they don't get it because they can't think of not being a part of the, the system or the machine, if you will. They can't think outside that box. And people that think outside the box are generally always thought of as dangerous, um, which is sad. Which is sad because... Thinking outside of the box and being creative shouldn't be looked at as a negative thing. Just because some guy doesn't want to get married, uh, doesn't want to get want to get involved seriously with women, or just go completely monk mode, you know, that shouldn't be looked at as a negative thing, or that there's something wrong with that. Um, you know, men should be able to do what the fuck they want, just like anybody should. But, you know, it's not gonna, it's not gonna get better, and it's, these men aren't gonna stop going their own way unless the system gets better. But, you know, even most MGTOW guys are just like, I'm not gonna try and fix any of this shit, I'm just gonna do my own thing. Which is... You know, it's a it's a totally rational response. MGTOW is a totally rational response 
to the way society treats men. Plain and simple. But that was my thoughts on that. Basically, I think, in my opinion, that one of the biggest reasons why MGTOW is looked down upon, hated so much, is because MGTOW men can't be controlled. And that's what it's all about. Controlling you. So go your own way, guys. Go your own way, boys. Keep doing your thing. Focus on yourself. Make yourself better. And have a great day. I love you all. Take care. Bye.